Creating an HTTPS inspection policy. Filtering takes place in the Guardian area of the smooth wall. HTTPS inspection can be accessed under Guardian, HTTPS inspection, manage policies. HTTPS encrypts traffic to maintain user privacy, which can be helpful when online shopping or banking. Increasingly, it's also being used to keep traffic private where this may not be desirable when trying to filter the traffic, such as the HTTPS Google search, where users can obscure their web searches. Creating a decrypt and inspect policy allows this content to be intercepted for inspection. Filtering rules can then be created for this traffic. Filtering policies in the smooth are defined by a set of simple logical parameters, who, what, where, when, and the action to be taken. Policy creation can be accessed on the policy screen or here in the policy wizard link in the quick link bar. Let's create an HTTPS inspection policy for inspecting secure traffic. First, we select the who, the individual group that we want the policy to apply to. In this case, we'll select everyone. To add choices to the policy you're creating, double click the option or click once and then click add. This will move the selection to the right for inclusion in the policy. If you make a mistake, just highlight again and click remove. Once you have the selection you would like, click next to move to the next step. The next policy choice is the what. Here we can choose from the categories or category groups defined in the smooth wall, or a custom category of your own creation. The secure search category includes HTTPS websites such as Google HTTPS search. Where is the location that we would like the policy to apply to? In this case, everywhere. When is the times we would like this policy to apply? This can be custom defined to suit the nuances of your own working day. We'll apply this rule at all times. Finally, we select the action we would like to be taken. Create policy folder is like creating a policy template to use later. We can choose to decrypt and inspect the traffic so a filtering policy can be created and applied to it. When a user browses in this way, a pop-up will be displayed to warn users their browsing is not private. Validate certificate only just validates the HTTPS certificate to ensure it is a trusted site. Or we can choose not to inspect the traffic, such as for online banking traffic, where we want to maintain the user's privacy. Here we will choose decrypt and inspect. Check that the policy enable box is ticked and confirm the policy to create it. The next screen summarizes your policy choices. If everything is correct, click to save it. You will return to the HTTPS inspection policies page and your new policy will appear at the bottom of the list. There is one vital last step to consider for successful policies and that is the order in which the rules appear in the page. Filtering rules will be applied to Guardian from top to bottom. That is to say that the logic of the top rule supersedes the next one down and so on. So it's vital to ensure that policies such as global rules to apply to all appear lowest in the list, with exceptions to the rule higher up to ensure that the smooth will applies them as you'd like it to. New rules automatically appear at the bottom of the list, but can be moved up and down using the up down buttons at the bottom right of the list or by clicking on the rule, holding it, and dragging the rule manually to the position you'd like. As this is a global policy, we've applied it to all. We will ensure this is in the bottom section with the other everyone, everywhere global rules. Click save to complete the policy setup.